Hello people and welcome to a makeup tutorial that absolutely no one and their mom asked for. I'm gonna present my makeup. Uh, I always do my makeup the same way and that's because I have no talent and I actually can't do it any other way. And then other fun fact is that I lost my makeup and my job. So I had to go buy the cheapest makeup ever so I can do like my usual makeup. But yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys how I do my makeup. First thing first is that I always start by my eyebrows. Um, I'm really shit at drying my eyebrows usually. So like someday they look like sister. Actually, no, I don't think they ever looked like sister. Someday if I get lucky, they look like cousin. But most days they look like neighbor. But yeah, usually I just do my eyebrows like this. Like remember 2016, like how the YouTuber, they used to like go crazy. And usually I used to have a, like a, I used to have the Fit Me foundation, but it's gone. So now I'm just using like concealer. That's the same color as my skin. So that's usually what I do. I kind of trace my eyebrows. And then after that, with the concealer, this one is exactly my skin color. So I kind of go here. I have a lot of like hyperpigmentation, which is a lot around my mouth. Okay, so we're back. Um, So that's usually what I do for my foundation, but then after that I go in. Okay guys, it looks so pale when I was in store and I had to buy this. Actually, first of all, okay, we talked about how even in 2024, um, skin color is still an issue. Like I was trying to find foundation and like you would see the same foundation like for white people, there's like 101, 102, 103, 104. And when it gets to like black skin, it goes like from 140 to like 160. This for my foundation because it's exactly the same color as my skin. And after that, this is like for, I only use the lighter one under my eyes like this. And guys, don't mind me, but like I always have to do this face. I don't know, I think it's like, I don't know why, I've just realized, someone was telling me, they're like, why do you do your fa that face when you do your makeup? And I was like, what face? I really look, look. But like, I think it's to get more space on my face. Cause like, because it's stressed, it's stressed. Oh my God. Because like my face gets, well, I got her head. But like, it was really humbling. Like when I was doing my makeup in front of someone and they're like, why is your face built like that? And I was like, um, <laughs> I'm literally doing my makeup to fix my face. <laughs> And then either the way, after that, I have the Fit Me powder. And Fit powder is really dangerous, guys. So, like, you have to be careful. Like, it goes everywhere. A little bit will get you far, okay? Really, that's, like, the thing with powder. A little bit will get you way far. So, like that. And usually, like, I just put it under my eyes. Because if you put it all over your face, I feel like it gets cakey over time and it doesn't look really good. I got closing. The powder is such a hassle. It goes everywhere. Okay, I have to clean my desk now. That's always fun. And then usually I have my lashes done. But like, girl. With the inflation of those days, I can't afford to have my lashes done. So this is my last set. So it's time for me to go back to my eyeliner face. And one trick that I can give you for eyeliner, I'm still pretty shit at eyeliner. But like one thing that sometimes works if I'm really trying to do like a nice eyeliner is like you put tape on their hair. And then after that, you just do your eyeliner and then take off the tape and it gives you like a perfect wings. But then the thing with that is that it kind of ruins your makeup. So if you have like a really done well makeup, like you have to like go and fix it, which can get annoying. 
so I can already see that it looks like shit. <sighs> okay guys, it's really not my day. It's really not working. I don't get why. Oh my god, it looks even worse in camera. Oh my god, why does it look? Okay, we're doing the other eyes. <sighs> you guys, eyeliner is not for me. I hate eyeliner, but like, guys, do you ever do your makeup and start crying because it doesn't work? Like, isn't makeup supposed to make you feel better? I should have got that tape. I should have gotten that tape a long time ago. The thing with eyeliner too is that when you try to go and fix it, you wings just get longer and longer. Because the more you fix it, the more eyeliner you're adding. And after that, you just look even worse. And that's what's happening right now. Like I'm trying to fix it, but like by fixing it, it just get longer. And I have those stupid lashes that I can't take off. Like makeup is not makeuping. The makeup is not makeuping. Oh my god. Guys, I'm actually so sad. Like, I was so excited to make this video, and now I look like shit. Like, what is this bullshit? Like, I miss my old makeup. Like, it's really the new makeup that makes me look like this. And then the final step usually that might do my makeup but final but most important step is literally the lips. So I use a brown lip liner. I don't do anything else but a brown lip liner. Um, and then just a regular lip gloss. And that's usually all I have for my makeup, guys. But it looks really bad, so I'm probably not gonna post this shit. Anyway, guys, so I had a little mental breakdown because I thought my makeup was actually really shit. But I realized the lightning can make, like, do a lot for makeup. And you know what? This makeup is not so bad. It just has to look for me from afar. And uh, we're chilling. But that's usually how I do my makeup, uh, minus the mental breakdown part because usually my makeup doesn't look so bad. But uh, <laughs> hopefully you guys enjoy. And um, that was like a quick video, guys. I really don't know. Like, I don't know how those people post on YouTube every day. I feel like my life is just so boring that I don't even know what to post. So I did a makeup look, but like, does anyone care? Probably not. But if you did. I'm happy you did.